Hello everyone. This is me Asim Rajpanda and today I am going to present a short presentation on forms in Microsoft Access. Let's see the contents first. The contents of this presentation are, introduction to forms, uses of forms, creating a form, entering data into a form, adding combo box into a form, and editing data using a form. Let's begin with the introduction to forms. A form is an important object of MS Access that allows us to create an interface for a user to enter data into our data sheet. Forms send the data entered by a user to a pre-specified table. Forms are generally made in graphical user interface GUI, format. Forms also allow us to view and edit the existing data in a table. Now, let's talk about the uses of forms. The uses of forms are, to enter data into a table. To view the data entered into a table. To update slash edit the data already existing in a table. To control the amount of data seen by a user. To prevent unauthorized editing of the data existing in a table. Now, let's talk about how to create a form. To create a form, follow the following steps. Step 1. Create a table with all the fields you want to include in the form. Save your table. Here, we will save it as example. Step 2. Now, click on the Create tab. Then, select the Form option. The form is created. Step 3. Save your form. In this case, we are saving it as example. Now, Let's learn how to enter data in Microsoft Access using Forms. Step 1. Open the form and click on the Form View button at the lowermost left side. Step 2. Type the data you want to enter in the form. Press Tab after you finish doing so. Your data should be shown in the table. Now. Let's discuss on how to add combo box in Microsoft Access. Step 1. Click the field of the form where you want to add a combo box. Step 2. Click on the combo box option and click on the field where you want to add combo box. Step 3. Select I will type the values I want option and click on next. Step 4. Type the options you want to give the user and click on next. Step 5. Give the name you want to give to the field and click on Next. Step 6. Delete the original field as it is no longer needed. Our combo box has already formed. Now, let's find out how to make changes to an existing field using forms. Step 1. Open the form and choose the row of the field you want to update. Step 2. Change the data of the field you want to update and press tab. You have now updated the data. Thank you.